Hi, eighth grade parents. My name is Ann Menning. I am the seventh and eighth grade religion teacher here at St. Pat's. And so we're in my classroom right now. And I just wanted to, um, I guess, welcome you to this process of confirmation year for your kids. It's very exciting. Um, they have a retreat coming up. And that's what um, I'm going to be here to talk about a little bit. We are inviting you as parents to pray for your kids leading into this retreat. And one of the really special parts of their day um, on their retreat day is to receive a letter from you. Um, and it's like a love letter, right? You're giving them your, oh gosh, <laughs> emotional as a parent thinking about this. Um, you're giving them your hopes and dreams and wishes for them. Um, particularly in regard to their faith in this journey that they're on this year. Um, it's a really powerful part of their day. And so um, we ask that you give yourself time and space to think about this letter that they will open on that day from you. So this day will be um, filled with a lot of special people from the St. Pat's community. Um, great leaders, um, student leaders, and adult leaders. And one of those people is our brand new youth minister, Sheridan Bonjop. So up next, you will get to hear from her. Thank you. Hi everyone, I'm Sheridan Bonjop and I am the new youth minister here at St. Pat's. Um, I'm super excited to get to know your kids and just to be able to share the love of Christ with all of them. Um, we're really looking forward to retreat and we can't wait to see everybody there. Hi, my name is Erin Keller and I'm the Director of Faith Formation at St. Patrick's. We are all so excited for this year and your children um, moving towards their confirmation. So I just wanted to speak as um, family who are cooperatively walking alongside your kids this year that they're going to be learning a lot of different things and getting to do service, which they've already been doing, um, and committing more deeply to different areas of their Catholic faith. And so as that's happening, sometimes it can be frustrating if that isn't lived out necessarily in our family life. And um, I had a daughter whose friend I remember was frustrated because she didn't know how to articulate that she really wanted to go to mass, but she wasn't able to get herself there. So just simple things like that, that we, um, you know, we're trying to work with you to help prepare your child and also that you're working with us to prepare your child. So just simple things that I know I have five kids, things can get crazy. Um, it's hard sometimes to make mass a priority or maybe confession if your kids are wanting to go. But I guess I'm just asking that um, while we are able to give some of those opportunities here that we're really here to help and support you and you walking alongside them in their faith. So if we can just kind of decide right now that for the rest of this year, we're all gonna walk along and do that together, that'd be great. And we're super excited to see you both at the retreat and at confirmation.